King Charles' big day could be overshadowed by another major event clashing with his coronation. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's son Archie will be celebrating his birthday on May 6 on the same day Charles will formally rise to the throne. The clash could deepen royal tensions between the royal household and the Sussexes. Earlier this year, Buckingham Palace announced the coronation date but did not offer further details as to why it was picked. The monarch will be crowned at Westminster Abbey, alongside his wife Queen Consort Camilla, at an event likely to bring together all members of the royal family, world leaders, state dignitaries and other religious figures. However, the royal event will happen on the same day as Archie's fourth birthday. The announcement of the date follows a slew of clashes between Harry and Meghan and the royal family since the couple left the firm in 2020. The clash came under sharper focus in early December, as the America-based couple made a series of allegations against the royal family in their Netflix DOCU series Harry Meghan. The couple accused the royal household, without giving names, of waging a media war against the Sussexes by deliberately planting negative stories about the couple in a bid to deflect attention from less favorable coverage of other royals. Jenny Affia, who is a partner at Schilling's law firm in London, said in the Netflix DOCU series, There was a real kind of war against Meghan, and I've certainly seen evidence that there was negative briefing from the palace against Harry and Meghan to suit other people's agendas. This barrage of negative articles about the breakdown of the relationship with her father was the final straw in a campaign of negative nasty coverage about her. In another damning accusation, the Duke of Sussex claimed his father's office leaked private correspondence between him and King Charles to the media over his plans to move to Canada. Prince Harry also said his brother, Prince William, screamed and shouted at him at a crisis summit in January 2020 at Sandringham in front of the Queen. His wife, Meghan, had deliberately not been invited to the gathering at which the couple's plans to step back from royal duties was to be discussed, Harry claimed. It remains unclear whether the feud will affect his son, Archie, who has not yet inherited the title of prince, which he should have technically got after the Queen's death. The Sussex's daughter, Lilibet, has not yet been given her princess title.